So, this truck is getting there now. And all the death and devastation in the front. So, instead of all the cut wires, we now have proper harnesses. The relay, auxiliary relay, is yet to be harnessed because I've got a problem with that green wire, which we'll probably see in a minute. We have buttons that work and light up with the dash. We have fend-offs. We have grills. More fend-offs. We've got lights up there. We've got lights up there. The sun sort of hides the TIR3s. We have load lights that work. Um, I think we've got a problem with the latch on the back of this one, but uh, if I slam it hard enough, it goes out. We have an extractor that doesn't work, and that's due to a problem with wire on the relays, which I'm going to address. We have working aircon and heating, which is lovely. All our auxiliary powers are energised and working, as they should be. And I'm waiting for the switch pack bits for here. But we have interior lights, you can't see the dim function. We have a trauma light. We have an extractor that doesn't work. And then we have that switch cap there, which is the he, um, heating and air conditioning, which is being overridden by the one in the cab. So yeah, it's been a really long uh, haul on this one, but we are finally there. <laughs>